Luca. So I am in the train station. I'm going to Minsk and I'm going with these guys right here from Spain. We will have a blast in Minsk. Okay, so there it happened some kind of weird situation about my trip to Belarus. They deported me. I don't need a visa to go to Belarus because I am from Ecuador and Ecuadorians don't need visa to go to Belarus. But we need insurance and I did not know about it. When I check in the website, it was not written that I need an insurance. So we went to the train, they took my ticket, we went in. We already crossed the border uh, and the security control came. Everything was great and then she said, do you have an insurance? And I say, what insurance? And she said, you need an insurance to come to Belarus. And I say, really? I didn't know about it. And she said, yeah, you need it. And I said, what can I do? Can I buy it now? And she said, no, you cannot buy it. You have to go back to Lithuania, buy it there and then come to Belarus. They took me out of the train. It was so sad because I was with all my friends. So I had, I got to go out. I was very disappointed about it. So I came to Vilnius today and I figured out that I can buy the insurance online and I bought it and it cost two euros. Anyway, that was what happened in my first attempt to go to Minsk. The city is empty, completely empty. The visit to the lake was nice. I was chilling, I was relaxing. What's up, That is the end of all this weekend and the beginning of the new week. Tomorrow I'm going to Poland, so I'm gonna be making some videos there. I will be back to Belarus for sure. Visagara. Ata.